But for the most part, we all understand that Jesus and what he done. But what is so hard about realizing in your own life that God, as much as I would like to, I'm just scared. I'm just scared to come back to you. You don't have to be scared. He's not going to come in here and turn your life upside down. All right? He's not going to make you stop smoking or drinking or dancing or doing whatever you want. What he's going to do is he's going to hear the knock. He's going to answer the door. He's going to let you in. And then your life will start with him. I think it was probably six months into my relationship with God before I realized, you know what? Some of the stuff I was doing that I love to do, that I thought that I couldn't come to God, all right, that I didn't think I was going to be able to let go, He let me continue that for six months, and I still had a relationship with Him. But the relationship kept growing through what other people would call sin. But let me tell you one thing. I came to a point around six months that I didn't want to do that anymore. I didn't need Sister Smith to tell me, you know what, you're sinning, you're going to hell, you're not truly saved. What I needed Jesus to do is to just come into my life and understand where I was, and He met me right there, and He walked me through six months of good times and of bad times. So it wasn't hard for me, and I understand if it's hard for you at times. But remember, that six months or whatever that time frame represents in your life, it could be a year. It could be two years. God does not have a witch watch that he watches the time. He's there with you, and however long it takes, with you, That's how long it takes. Mm 